Welcome to AppChasers.com. Today we want to show you a neat trick that will convert basically any audio file that you find on the internet into a ringtone for your iPhone using only your iPhone. The trick to do this is to use an app called Tone Convert, which is available in the iTunes App Store. We'll show you how to do that right now. You can see we've got Tone Convert up in the uh, upper left hand corner of our screen. We'll open that and the first step is to browse for an audio file. Now this will bring up the built-in browser within uh, Tone Convert here and we've got it set to audioco.com so that's i.audico.com and we can search for ringtones right from within that website. So let's look for a Super Mario ringtone here. We'll just type in Super Mario We'll click return. Now this brings up the different options of Mario ringtones or just tones that we can load into our iPhone. So we'll select the first one here. Now when we select the file it's going to ask us if we want to play it to preview what if it's actually the tone that we want to use or we can just download it right then. We can now download that song. So we'll click download. That's going to bring it right into the Tone Convert app where we can then click the convert it button here. It's going to just take a second to convert that file. Now we copy it to pasteboard. Now that's all that we need Tone Convert to do because the rest of the process of actually creating the ringtone will happen in GarageBand which we'll, so, we'll show you now. Now we've got GarageBand open on our iPhone. In the upper left hand corner we'll want to start a new song by clicking on that plus sign and add the instrument which is called Audio Recorder. So we'll click on that. Now once this is open we're going to see in the upper left hand corner our track view button. That looks like the five dash lines here. So we'll click on that track view. This is going to bring up the track view uh, within GarageBand and you can see here we can scroll in this area here along that audio recorder track but what we want to do is in the first cell of that track we want to quickly touch it and paste that converted audio file that we got from Tone Converter. So it's very simple just touch it real quick the paste button will come up and we'll paste it right in there. Now we can preview it Okay, that sounds like the song we want. It's the right tone. So we can go and click on our down arrow here in the upper left. Go to My Songs. Now we'll hit the Select button in the upper right. Select our song and tap the Share button in the upper left. Now this is where we can create our ringtone. So we'll tap on the Ringtone button. Export Ringtone uh, dialog box comes up. We'll tap here to name our song. We can call it Mario and we'll click export. So it's exporting as a ringtone now and it's going to bring up an option to set that for a, a contact. We'll click on use sound as. We can set it as a contact ringtone, our standard default ringtone, or a text tone here. So let's, uh, we don't actually need to pick any of those because it's already been sent to our settings app. So let's go into our settings app and we'll show you how to select that newly created ringtone and use it as a ringtone on our iPhone. Now here we are in our settings app. We'll scroll down to the sounds category here. We'll click on that. Now you can see our different uh, tones that are available here. So we've got we can set our ringtone, which would be anytime someone calls our phone, text tone when we receive a text message, voicemail, and so on. Let's click on ringtone and we'll see the different tones that we have available here to choose from. You can see I've already created a number of them using Tone Convert, but we've got our a tone that we called Mario here available. So we can click on that and now that's going to be our default ringtone anytime someone calls our phone. So that's how to create a ringtone right on the iPhone using the app Tone Convert and GarageBand. This has been AppChasers.com.